time to check out Clubhouse, a large size map with a focus on rotation and mobility. This map features three floors, the first floor, second floor, and basement. Located on the first floor, the bar is the map's largest and most important area. It's divided into three sections, pool table, bar, and stage. This whole area is filled with many destructible walls and floor sections, and connects to key areas of clubhouse, both vertically and horizontally. West from the bar is the pool table section, where you can breach directly into the strip club through a destructible wall. The western hallway leads you back to the pool table section, back into the bar. On the east side, you can breach directly into the stockroom from the stage wall. In the lounge, the eastern stairs lead to the second floor, while the blue stairs in the garage storage lead to the basement. The last room of the first floor's east section is the garage. Note the trap door that gives access to the basement and the stairs leading to the mezzanine on the second floor. You can breach the destructible wall to go through the lounge and lobby and back into the bar. To the north is the kitchen with a trap door that leads you to the basement, the toilets that give you access to the western hallway, and the central stairs that lead both to the basement and second floor. The second floor consists, among others, of the bedroom hallway and the gym. Breach through a destructible wall to access the bedroom and the logistic office with its secret stash. From the logistic office, you can access the construction hallway through a breachable wall. The construction hallway also leads back to the bedroom. Note the destructible wall on the east side leading to the balcony. It's a good access point to the second floor. East of the construction hallway are the cash room and CCTV room. Next to this room are the eastern stairs we've seen earlier that lead to the lounge on the first floor. Back to the CCTV room. From the south of the room, you can access the mezzanine through the destructible wall or the window next to it. Take it to access the garage and note the overview of the first floor from the mezzanine. Let's go down for a second time into the garage, a good access point to the basement. From the garage, use the red ladder to go down to the oil pit located in the basement. Move north to access the utility room. Located east are the blue stairs we've seen earlier that lead up to the garage storage on the first floor. Be aware that you can easily be spotted here. Here you can breach through this destructible wall into the church, memorial room, and basement hallway with the central stairs we've seen earlier that lead back up to the central hallway on the first floor and the bedroom hallway on the second floor. Using the basement hallway, you can access the arsenal room, this area's most important room. This location holds many objective sites, features lots of destructible ceiling sections, and is easily reachable from other areas of the map. Also note the escape tunnel that leads outside to the construction site spawn point. Clubhouse features four spawn points. To the north is the construction site entrance. On the east side is the warehouse spawn point. Located south is the main gate entrance. Finally, on the west side is the shipping dock spawn point. Overall, the bar area is the central point of the map. The garage gives access to both the basement and second floor. Clubhouse focuses on many rotation and mobility options. Also keep in mind the map's verticality. Clubhouse is full of trap doors and destructible floors. Are you ready, operators? Let's move in.